Good morning everybody, Jacob here from The Nutrition Store and welcome back to another episode of the TNS Vault. Guys and girls, recently I have gotten very bored with my traditional workout routine, so I've switched things up, gone back to the basics to an upper-lower style training split. Today I wanted to take you guys through one of our upper body vertical days, so let's go. I have been training in the same style of routine for probably the greater half of two years. And that's great and all, you know, once I get to a certain level of expertise in the gym, you've got to kind of devote a single day to each body part. You know, it's one thing to say, do full body work workouts, but once you can bench press 405 or more, squat more than 600 pounds, you kind of have to add more volume per session. So that's what I've done for the past few years. But recently I've wanted to switch it up to increase my frequency. I want to go upper, lower, and do this two to three times a week so that I can generate my volume across a seven day span. So that's what I've been doing. I personally have been enjoying it. And I'm just going to run you guys through kind of what we've got going on today and our progression speed. Let's go. Don't be a poon, man. Don't be a what? Don't be a poon. <laughs> no poons allowed. <laughs> So what we do here is the overhead press and we're supersetting it with pull-ups. Now pull-ups are just a body weight exercise, so they're gonna be good at training the same vertical plane of motion as well as training your lats, your biceps, and more. What are we going to next, Sam? Shoulder press. Ooh. I was just telling Sam, I'm not used to having my heart rate up at all in between sets. You know, we're used to doing like pro workouts where our heart rates aren't elevated that much. We're at 112. Yeah, like that, and that's that's not bad. But I'm also sitting at a 52. <laughs> Scale of one to ten, how much do you like TNS Paul? Seventy-seven. So you can kind of see what we're doing here is a push and pull style matrix with our training. Notice Sam did his wide grip pull downs with a shoulder press machine, whereas I'm doing them with uh, push ups. Reason for that, a lot of it's just specific based on what you're wanting to go for, but hey, give it a try. here is single arm standing dumbbell press and we're going to superset it with single arm cable rows. Now is this necessarily all a vertical workout? No. We have to work in certain horizontal planks of motion to get our chest 
a rhomboid hit, but these are good supersets that we like to throw in to save time and also get a lot done. So 